All right, you guys want to see some fucking guns? What do I need to click this button? Yeah, that button. Alright, time to see some fucking fat pussies. So this first one, I just got it literally yesterday, I think, maybe. So this is my scoped Mosin. I just got it. Look how sexy that is. I got a chub now from that. Look how sexy that is. Uh, the bolt is not original, neither is the scope and mount. A uh, company up in Ohio basically made this thing from a regular Mosin, and it looks pretty fucking smexy. I just wanted a Mosin that I could have fun with and shoot that had a scope. So I got, I saw this and it was a really good price, and I was like, dude, I fucking want it. And I bought it. And it was a bitch to get. It took like three fucking weeks since I got it. And uh, I wonder, can you even see down the scope? No, no. Left, middle, ah, it's not worth it. But yeah, that's my new scoped Mosin. It's, uh, we're going to uh, defeat the Germans. No, let me try that again. Me and Dmitri, we go defeat many Germans. I can't do the Russian accent anymore. I'm too autistic. But yeah, that's my scoped Mosin. It's pretty fucking smexy. And uh, yeah, we're gonna go take back the a. Uh, gonna go take back the motherland, dude. Let's go. Let's fucking go. The next scoped gun I have is the scoped car. We went to knock and Torten, and uh, we got my scoped car 98. And this is my this is by far the most expensive and my favorite gun that I own. I don't know if we showed this off. Did we show that? No, we did not. This was new. This is sorry. So this is new. We have not showed this. We did not show this off for that gun video last time. So this is the next one. This is my baby, dude. This one. This one's my favorite. I love it. This is so sexy. This is this is a K98. With a scope, uh, from what I heard from the guy that sold it to me, the scope mount is a reproduction scope, or the scope mount is a repo, but the scope is original, but it's not matching to this car 98. It was, you found on a different one or something like that. I, I, I bought it a while ago. I don't really remember what he said, but this is definitely my favorite and the most expensive one that I have. And I love shooting it. And I mean, don't hate me. I love shooting it. Why buy a gun if you're not going to shoot it, right? You guys have all seen it. It's the M1 Grand. You've all seen it. You know what it is. This is also one of my favorites to shoot. This one heats up really fucking quick. I mean, I shoot proper M1 Grand, Grand ammo. I got the gas plug changed out for it for a, uh, you know, a better... I got... The fuck, I can't remember what it's called. There's a new gas plug you can switch out from the old one. I don't know what it's called. I can't remember off the top of my head. But I got a bunch... I changed out the gas plug. I used the right ammo for it. And it still just heats up like a motherfucker. But I love shooting it. It's so much fun. It's, dude, it's the M1 Grand. How could you not, how could you not fucking like that shit? And, uh, well, we got to do the ping. Go in there. All right. We got, I mean, we got to do it, right? We got to do it. We got to do it. Thank you, Cammy Hunt. War crimes ahoy. War crimes ahoy. I, I thought that was going to hit my computer, and I got really scared. Ugh. I don't remember if we showed this one in the gun video, but uh, this is my Springfield, 1903 Springfield. I believe, if I remember correctly, it was made in 1927. How much do these airsoft guns cost? They're real. Suck my little titties. <laughs> this is my 1903 Springfield. I love shooting this too. It's just really... Bolt actions are so much... Dude, you feel like such a man when you shoot them. It's so much fun. Uh, suck my dick gun, guy. But uh, this is what I'm going to be shooting Black Ops 4 with. So I have a copy of Black Ops 4. And I'm going to shoot it with the Springfield. This is like the gun Verrucks that sucks. And that quote-unquote takes two shots on insta-kill or whatever. That's the Springfield. Love it. I can't wait to go record this video with it. Uh, recording it Thursday. Thursday. And ooh, I really bought that jack. This. 
This is the Arasaka. You've all seen this, so I can go over this one kind of quick. This one's tall. I right, look at that. That's a tall fucking gun. All the other ones were like way down here. This one's pretty tall. I'll compare this to the Springfield so you can just see how much of a difference. Uh, this is a Type 38. Not this is a Type 38, not a 99. That's the Arasaka. This is the Springfield. Much, much, much difference. Many differences. Many, many differences. But this is also really fun to shoot. Um, that's pretty, like, usually when you play in games, you use a Type 99. This is a Type 38. And I mainly just like it because it's cool, man. It's an Arasaka. What, could you, what, what do you not like about it? It's an Arasaka. We can go over this one pretty quick because you guys, you know, you know what it is. You know it. You know what it is. You know it. The PPSH, boys. I got the chode on it because it makes it legal. And, you know, reasons. I can't afford a real World War II. I mean, this is a real World War II one. I can't afford a fully auto one. Shit's expensive as fuck. And I don't got that kind of money. But I do got enough for a semi-auto one has been converted. So, why not, yo? Look how smack... That just looks good. I don't care who you are. That just looks good. I can get this chopped off eventually, but I'm waiting till I move back down to Florida to, or to do that, so... You just can't go wrong with the PPSH. You just can't. You've all seen this one, so yeah, I can go over this one pretty quick. I see what you want. Oh yeah, I'm still streaming. Yeah. Listen, we died a lot in that game. Oh, I was just gonna tell you probably the best time to see that one out. Of course. And that doesn't surprise me at all. Do we get a free? Do we get the keyboard tux? If they ever send them to us. Shit, they better send it to us then. Pro tip: President President Tuxedo's going out of business. You've you've all seen this a million times. I don't know why I gotta show this one to you. seen the Luger you've seen it I actually got the good magazine this time you've seen it it's always the mag so I got a lot of people give me a lot of shit last time for uh saying that I always have the magazine in the magazine's never in this gun unless I'm shooting it it's just always next to it just in case like ninjas were to come in here This one, I do actually always keep loaded, but I just unloaded it. This one's always loaded. This is my conceal and carry. This is my 1911. This is my baby. The sights are off on it. I need to fix the sights because it shoots up and to the right a little bit. And I was wondering for the longest time why I was so... Me and Heather, we're, for the longest time, we're wondering why we were so inaccurate with this. And then we got a laser uh, inside of it, and it was aiming up and to the right. So it just took a fat minute. I, I, thought I, was just, I thought I was just bad at shooting. But then I shot my Luger, and I was accurate as fuck with that. But, yeah, so it ends up and to the right. This is my conceal and carry gun. I always have it. That's my baby. That's my that's my baby.
it. Last but not least, the Thompson. The only reason I still have this is because it looks cool, or else I would have sold it a long ass time ago. Long ass time ago. So the only reason I still, yeah, the sights are off on my conceal and carry weapon, but it's not like I'm fucking shooting like ten yards up and to the right. It's like an inch up and two inches to the right. So unless the guy's like 50 feet back, I'm pretty sure I'm going to still hit him. It's fucking your concealed carry weapon, not your I'm going to fucking war weapon. Idiot. <laughs> but this is my Thompson. I only have it because it looks cool. I hate it with a passion. Uh, I would sell it, but it looks cool. So it's the only... It's the only you could fucking... Ooh, two, three, four, five. It's heavy. I hate it. I hate shooting it. It's heavy, especially when loaded. It's a pain in the ass. Not, not, uh, not my biggest, uh, wish I would have got the, the lighter version, but I did it. And then last but not least, Everyone needs a planking gun. This is a 22. Everybody needs a little 22. Pew! No recoil at all. Literally just pew! 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 Everyone needs a 22. It's so much fun. Everyone needs one. It's ammo is cheap as shit. Everyone needs one. It's just, you need one. Oh, I do have Arasaka ammo. Hang on. I forgot. I just recently bought 100 rounds of it. I did. I'm so fucking smart. I'm glad I did. This shit's the most expensive. I mean, after I said this was the most expensive, I had so many other people saying, oh, my gun's so much more expensive. But I got a, finally got a bunch of Arasaka ammo. And this shit's like $1.50 a round. Definitely the cheapest, or not the cheapest, the most expensive ammo I have. Not a fan. Why is it still, why you gotta be so expensive, Holmes? Why you gotta be so expensive, eh? Yeah, that was my grandpa's gun. That's the only reason I haven't gotten rid of it yet. Because I don't want to get rid of it. Sell the Thompson to buy a lighter one with the money? Ah, it's, like, I've, I've had it for so long, it's just, I don't want to spend any more money on getting a fucking Thompson or anything. I'm happy with what I got. But that's all my guns, boys. I don't expect to get any new ones anytime soon. Hopefully. Maybe. I don't know. What are you guys what was your guys' favorite? What'd you guys like? What were your guys' favorite ones? Out of every single one we got, we got the Arasaka, Springfield, M1 Grand, Car 98, Mos Nagant, PPSH, MP40, Thompson, Luger. 1911 22 plink 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 gun which one's y'all's favorite which one you guys like the most